Top five legends for gun run gun run is the latest limited time game mode that's been offered to apex legends it's similar to the gun game in other call of duties except for you're based in a team and you're not going up through every single gun because your teammates will take other guns and you'll just keep hopping up until you get to the end which is a throwing knife to win the game my rank goes off their tactical their ultimate and if their passive ability plays into the specific speed and play style of this game mode. At number five, we have Revenant. You might be shocked by this, but you gotta think about it. Both of the maps, height is crucial. So being able to climb and take off angles and surprise people is very efficient. His silence ability either blocks off visually or physically because people don't want their ability silenced, or it silences their abilities and they can't run away or use them against you. The reason why I put him at five and not higher is because he doesn't have a speed element and his ultimate is helpful but it's not super practical. At number four, we have Wraith. And the two main reasons why we have rank Wraith so high up on this list is just because of her tactical ability being able to get away and the fact that she has a small hitbox. When it gets to snipers and marksman rifles, it's nice to have a small hitbox, not giving people free damage or free kills on you. Her tactical is great for being able to get away, reposition, possibly reheal. The reason Wraith's not higher up on this list is the fact that her ultimate only lasts for 60 seconds and where you spawn changes. So sometimes her ultimate is not very beneficial. At pick number three, we have Horizon. The reason why we have Horizon so high is just for her ability to get not only herself, but her whole team at different levels of height with her tactical ability. With the different height levels of the two maps that are available, being able to have her passive ability jumping off roofs and be able to not take that impact is crucial to be able to relocate or heal or just be able to push someone who's trying to run away. However, her ultimate is just not practical in this game mode. At number two, I have Pathfinder. Now Pathfinder does have a large hitbox, so you might be asking, why do I have him so hot? Simple because his ultimate ability is great for getting whole teams up to height in different positions. The best part about it is it never goes away. Pathfinder's ultimate stays for the entire game mode. So you can take that same angle over and over again, unlike Wraith or Ash or other legends in the game where the ultimate disappears after a certain amount of time. His grapple ability, if you're good with the grapple, you're just a demon on the sticks because you can push fights, get away from fights, get height, and do it in a quick amount of time and make it look very impressive. But the number one legend in Apex Legends gun run is Octane. And the reason why is just because of the tactical ability. This passive is nice to be able to regain health, but if you play the game very fast, like I do, I'm constantly pushing so that that passive doesn't play into it. Like Pathfinder, Octane's ultimate stays around for the entirety of the round. So being able to throw it at spots near height and being able to have that tap strafe ability where you're harder to hit than if you were on a pathfinder zip line just makes it even better for you and for your teammates guys if you like this video please drop a like and subscribe i don't know about y'all but i hope they keep this game mode for a very long time i have a great time playing it solos and playing it with teammates